everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review on these new matte, 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 long lasting lip glosses. Now you may see or notice that I only have four here and there are five in the collection. When I bought these and I swatched them on my hand, number five, the darkest shade, number five, made me look hideous. The undertone did not go with my skin and I looked like pale and um, I have been in the sun so I'm not that lily white. Um, so I decided not to buy it. So if your skin can handle dark, dark lips and like a bluey undertone, then go for it. But just a heads up that I did not buy the fifth one. So if you are looking to buy these matte, 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 long lasting lip glosses, um, here is a video for you before you decide which colours um, you would enjoy. This is not a lipstick, it is a lip gloss, um, although I have swatched them on my hand and they are very, very, very pigmented. So they could fall in between the two. I do find it is a dupe for the NYX um, lingerie um, matte lip gloss. They are very, very similar. So yeah, if you want to see a review and the colours on these Essence Long Lasting Lip Glosses, then let's just get started. Right, first I'm going to start off with number one. It's the La Vie Es Bella. It's a pinky, light pink shade. Um, and let's see what it's all about. Right, so this is the pink. It's a very nice dusty baby pink shade. They go on extremely well and they smell, uh, smell like baking, something icing or something, but anyway, it's delicious. Um, I really like this color, it's a, it will look nice with a, a nude or even a smoky eye and then a, a pinky lip, um, yeah, um, I'm liking this one. But, is a little bit, um, how can I say, cakey. Um, you've got to really, your lips, to get it all smooth and even. It's a little bit streaky, but it, it's good. They are quite a moussey texture, and the wand is actually, looks all messy, but it's actually quite um, easy to apply. And if you can see, yeah, so far, so good. Right, so next up we have number two, Beauty Approved. This is like a nudie brownie, um, yeah, nudie brownie um, color. And yeah, let's see how this one goes on. I am loving this color. Me and brown lipsticks with blonde hair and green eyes definitely are my favorite. Um, this definitely lives up to its velvet description. Um, it is matte, but it's so creamy and it's so velvety. It just makes your lips feel so good. Okay, so this is Beauty Approved, number two. I am loving this color. This is a good everyday work, work color. Right, so next up is number three. This is got a bluish undertone, but it didn't look so bad on my skin. Let's see how it goes. This is called Girl of Today, number three. And it's a pinky, browny, ready color. So let's see. I 
cannot believe how well these apply. You don't even need a lip liner. Okay, my lips are a little bit red from the removal of the other product, but they're great. Um, I'm really liking this color. I didn't think I would enjoy this color so much. Um, it's got a little bit of a peachy, orangey, ready pink tinge, just looking in the mirror. Um, but I like it. The, the best thing I like about these products is the, the texture and the way that this product goes on. It really smells really delicious and feels delicious. I'm enjoying these. I'm really enjoying these. Last but not least in my collection is number four Ready, Set, Impress. Um, as I did mention in the beginning, I have not purchased number five. I can't remember what it is called. Um, I will insert a picture after this review and just show you, but I have not bought number five. So this is the last one in my collection and it's definitely more red. This is a huge deal for me because I don't really wear that much dark lipsticks. So let's check it out. Well, I can't say I'm particularly mad about it. Um, maybe for an evening look or a pretty summer's dress, um, red look, red dress, red look. Um, but for myself, I wouldn't do it every day. Um, but this is not to say it's not a beautiful color, it really is. People always say that I'm to wear red because it goes with blonde, but I don't know why I've got this thing about red lips. But, yeah. So, so, 50 50. And that is my review on my four my four little babies from Essence. Um, whoopsie. I am really impressed with them. Um, they are, they have beautiful um, colors in the collection. The smell is amazing, amazing. The texture is amazing. Um, I definitely would suggest you go and pick your color and buy it. Um, but thank you for watching and if you would like to see more reviews on different products, please um, leave a comment below. Please subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you like what you see. And don't forget to stay tuned for my review on the other Essence products, the other um, new Essence products. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video.